Hello, Internet! Praise be to God, and welcome back to more Sablems. Continuing with the murder rank, we're on level 15, the Gravity Coaster. We can kill four lemmings on this one. Three lemmings, not four. Sorry, I was looking at the number of lemmings, it was 40. And it's another Sonic tile set level. Goody. <laughs> I do like those upward stars. Two hatches. Oh boy, ten stackers. It's going to be hard to make that interesting, Flopsy. I'll just tell you that right now. One of my Art Limbs levels does have 11 stackers. And the only reason for that is to seal back roots. Or, like, they're all used in a cool way. And I normally would try to lessen it, but they're all needed to prevent back roots. Okay. Well. This is going to stink. Interesting that it's a go-down level as opposed to a go-up level. Oh! I think that's what you're supposed to do. Where is he gonna land? Okay, what I want him to do is land on the first platform there, yeah. So then they're all trapped in there. As per the colorful art of usual, I am, don't have any real plan going into this level. I'm just gonna do what feels right. takes me up here. No diggers, that's gonna be a bit of a problem. Send you to outer space. Perfect. Just like that. Oh yeah, so we will make you a climber? Oh, that's right. Well, you know what? This is where we've got ten stackers. Here's a level where walkers would come in handy. Okay, so we can use that as a bridge. Alright, so ideally I would like to stop my gliders from becoming climbers. If I do that, he'll fly down. Okay, cool. You can be a climber. This guy is not going to be a climber. Trying to figure out a way to lessen this fall. But it's trickier than it sounds. Is 
So that's going to take, I think, three stackers. And he's just going to die like a moron. Okay. Well, we'll have to try to fix that now, won't we? Those free lemmings, so I mean, maybe we can just build over the blocker and save the uh, bomber for something like down here. That would be lovely. I have a lot of constructive skills, so I'm not super worried about exhausting them. Alright. I don't know. How many pixels is there between that? A reasonable amount. Okay, okay. So now I need to find a way to break the fall for these guys. That's going to be a bit tougher. How did I not... Oh, they don't just fall onto that platform? I thought they did! I thought the stacker extended that far. Oh, the stacker does extend that far. They're just being idiots and bashing for all of it when I don't want them to. No, the stacker even then just doesn't extend that far. Doggone it. So I've got to fence them out of there. There's no two ways about that. Then I can do a double build there, and they should have a nice little staircase to the bottom. I'll have to stack there to make up the difference, but yeah, that could work. <laughs> So right off the gate, that guy can go stack up those stairs and then build up there. That'll give him a place to not splat, which will be nice. So I'll use quite a few stackers just there. Alright, I'm going to need one guy to do that. Trap him in. Uh, one to do... everything else, maybe? That could be nice.
Well, actually, two builders will save him from that. So I can use two builders at the bottom, one over there. I don't know what I'm doing. And you glided way too far down. Here's gonna be the problem. Unless that somehow stopped. Oh, maybe that's the key. Dog flipping on it. Builders, I think, are going to be much more valuable than stackers. Ah, darn it, that doesn't stop them. Maybe if I stretch the bridges... Maybe that'll make the difference. Alright, come on... Okay, and now he's leaving that annoying pixel. That's just great. It's gonna take three stackers to seal that up. I really don't want to do that. I think I'm using too many stackers there, because especially with this idiot gliding all the way. Unless I send another glider from the beginning. I think this will be about multitasking. then that should provide a splat for him. Yep.
let's try this. This is gonna be so freaking annoying. Do we have to save like all our builders for the end? Cause I mean we can bash through there. Then we're gonna need like a lot of builders. A lot of builders. blocker. I guess I never realized that. We could put that at the exit. If we could ever find a way to get around that. What happens if you go down like that? Okay, he just goes under the ceiling because glider hitboxes are incredibly weird and dumb. Hmm. Alright, working backwards. We are going to need one builder at the end. We're going to need two or three builders to get through there. So we're gonna need, we can use four builders for sure in this area. We're gonna need one to get there. Okay, okay. Zvari. I definitely have the right idea with this group. And no one can tell me otherwise. I mean, it's too perfect to not use that staircase, right? Let's, okay, let's just see how much of this I can do with this one lemmy. That's better. Aha, if I do that... Well, I mean, I'm gonna have to build from farther back, but... Okay, I like that, though. Cool. So that gives those guys a splat for them to go off of. Still gonna have to find a way to turn someone around. stack here at the beginning, which seems weird, but bear with me, I do have a plan. And you're going to be a climber since you're going to have to climb anyways. 
Alright. You're gonna build at the tippy toe edge there. You're gonna glide down. Oh, hang on. First, you are going to build there. You are gonna build there. You're gonna glide down. Now you are going to bash through that ahead of time for these guys when they have to eventually be let out. Seems like a bit of a waste. There you go. Let's just see where that all goes. Oh, you could climb up to the top real quick, couldn't you? It seems like a little bit of a waste. And again, you have no real need to be on that platform, so... We need two builders. No, we need three builders still. That's, so that's still a bit wasteful. Well, I don't, we only need one stacker down here, though, so I should just go overboard with my stackers, I guess. do everything with one glider. Well, no, it makes sense to have two since I'm going to need two to come down on this side anyways. So I need a bridge over that way to stop them from splatting. I can do two stackers here. Yeah, two stackers there could be because then that would give me enough to stretch across here. If that's possible. Which it should be. I might just have to tamper with the release rate a bit. Okay. I can lower the release rate there. These two are going to stretch the stack across. I guess I didn't need you to do that. Well... It'll help. <laughs> and now that guy's stuck. Okay. I like where that's going. Alright, going off of this. So now I need a stacker over there, which leaves me five left. I'm going to need three up there, that'll leave me with two left. I need one down there, which leaves me with one left. So we're going to need one to get up there. Okay. Well, and then we need one there, so that's a problem. Or maybe it's not. I have him bash right through that. He should hopefully glide all the way down there and not die. Guess I need to build from... Here, let's... Yeah, let's try that. T no, you're supposed to touch down. Come on. So I would bash through here. Not good. He will touch down, but that's still not good. Alright. 
Yeah, he even comes out. Okay. Alright, then you're gonna have to stack farther ahead then. If that's gonna if that's gonna be the thing. You've got a stack like right there, buddy. On touchdown! Oh, good grief, that is precise as I'll get out. Oh, and you're just gonna fly right over it like an idiot. Oh, I can lose free lemming, so I'm gonna lose the two blockers. And uh, I can't afford to lose that idiot. Well, no, because he lands on the stacker, too. Curse you. I can't slow him down. Not enough, though. Curse you! I need this to work out perfectly, don't you know? Where does he land? Too far ahead, that's where he lands. But I don't really see any way around it, because we need... Three stackers up there. Oh no, we don't. We don't need free stackers up there. I just realized. Put a stacker there. You can put a stacker at the edge there. Well, let me just make sure that's lined up perfectly. It's not. That ought to do it. Alright. Now to deal with Mr. Trapped in the stack. Oh no, I do need him to climb up. Oh shoot. Builder over there. Hmm. Oh yeah, I do need to get on there, duh. Alright, so seven builders left. Need three for the bottom, so that essentially gives me four to use up here. I need one there, so that gives me three left. Need two up there, so that gives me one left. No. Have I already used too many builders? Because I'm going to need two to get over that. Or maybe even three. 
And I'm gonna need two to get up there. I'm gonna need two to get up there. I am not happy about this. At all. I haven't tried going up the top of the loop. I guess I might as well try that next. Yeah, I'm just gonna see what this leads to. This might make my life a bit easier. Because if I could use two builders there... Yeah, this is gonna be my new plan. <laughs> I'm gonna let these guys do all the work. We need one from each side. Because if we got this guy from this... Oh my gosh. Can he do this in one? No, he can't do it in one builder. Oh, never mind. I thought we could just build twice and stop them from splatting. But that's not happening. doing it right, though, with the double stacker. Hmm. The double stacker thing was actually clever, which makes me feel like it would be the main trick for the level. Trying to figure out the most efficient way to get them down. Because the one builder there seems like a good idea. The two stackers there is a nice stretch downwards, and then it's just... Oh, we can get away with one. If we put a stacker there, we can get away with one builder. Cool! I don't really see any benefit to sending them on that side, in hindsight, so... do that. So just to make sure I got this right. So we get it with one, two, Four, five. So that's half our stackers down there. We also then need six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. So that's too many stackers. Hmm. 
Yep, that is just thick enough that you need two stackers. I think. Time to test. Oh, one is enough to get over that. I must not have built at the very edge then. Okay. Cool. So this should work then. So we need the one guy down there. He's going to stack there. Stack there. Build up. Then stack at the bottom. This guy's going to come here. Stack at the edge. Turn around. Build. I guess I'll need to send another guy after that just to bash through this. Well, no. The crowd can bash through the stack pretty easily. I still don't have an account for how to get past the blocker, though, because we're going to need two blockers. So builders, we need three at the bottom, we need one there, we need one there. So that's five. And we have two remaining. Okay, yeah. Yeah, this should hopefully work. Don't know why he gave me so many gliders and climbers. That might be like a hint of some kind, but I can't really see. I love the ruler. Oh, come on, you should not have hit that. Well, I guess he should have. This is precise as all get out. Oh my gosh! Pixel perfect, but that should work. So now we got four builders left. Yeah, this should work. This hopefully should work out perfectly. How did you get over that? No. Why would you do that? Stop it. You are ruining the entire level by doing that. The entire level is ruined because you did that. What, did you measure that pixel by pixel just to screw people over, Flopsy? Because that is not cool. I've done everything perfectly and you still refuse to give it to me.
That is perfect. That is perfect. I guess that's not quite perfect. Okay, two forward. Yep, even as perfect as it is, it's still not enough for Flopsy the Mighty. He still says, screw you, and you don't deserve it. Flopsy? You're not beating me. I'm getting this to work. One way or another, I am getting this to work. this to work. I could time that just perfectly. Two pixels backwards, maybe? Well, yes, I am getting this pixel perfect. could have even moved that far forward, but I didn't. Turns them around anyways. I'm sorry, but that should not be what happens. to go one pixel forward? Yes, I do. I have to go one pixel forward. Oh, I didn't have to do that, I guess. Artie means business. Business. 
Excuse me, why did you not turn around? You were literally right up against the steel. Oh, I had it right the first time, did I? I'm still too low. One pixel too low, it is just... it is stupid. So this model basically just hates players, and that everything you do will end in failure. Guaranteed. I wish there was a horizontal ladder that let you know how many builders it takes to go a certain place. I really wish there was a way. For freaking real! One stupid little pixel. Unfortunately, I don't think that's going to play a huge role. Oh, I really hope it doesn't play a huge role. And now we can't build over the blocker. This level's really stupid, Flopsy. I'm just saying that. Because everything is just like, oh, that just doesn't work because of one pixel. And that's when you line everything up pixel perfect. What more do you want from me, Flopsy? I've done this level, like, perfectly. Literally perfectly, pixel perfect, everything is perfectly timed, and yet it's still not working. And I'd also see no use for this platform here. At all. Unless you save all your builders from the bottom, like, there's no way you're gonna make that work. I am 
I'm going to make this work. It's stupid that it doesn't work. Just want to build it. But there's not enough room to build. Now, here's a level that is on par with the Slime Castle level. So I don't remember how, but there was a way that I got onto that step and saved a stacker. I may have had to do something weird though, like, oh yeah, that's right, using a builder that way, which is a waste. Hmm. I'm so close I can taste it. Lower the ceiling by a pixel, please. I think you'll agree that it is warranted. Cool, now they can just bash and they are all hunky-dory okay to go over here. This is where the problems arise. And this is one of the reasons why I hate the Starlight Zone and Scrap Brain tile sets because of these dumb curves. Unless we have to do the opposite and somehow land on here. New plan. Probably a bad plan, but at this point I'm willing to try anything. Congrats you a lot. Died. Oh, the dumb climber. 
Well, we can solve that. All right, third stacker in the list. supposed to do that. Yeah. This level is definitely one of my least favorite in the pack, which is a shame because this pack has been very strong thus far. I was thinking, hey, maybe we could send the lemmings, like, get two lemmings to not even beat gliders until they reach this point, but I don't think that's going to work out. Then again, nothing's been working out anyways, so... I really like what I did here. Stack there, stack there, build once there, build once there. I think that is a golden strategy. I also feel like the gliders should probably bash up here, and everybody else bashes lower down. That way we can stack at a more appropriate place. Okay. this point. No! Why? You were so stupid. Climber better not be able to get out of there. We're going to use two stackers there and one down there, so we do have a spare stacker. So we could stack up there and hopefully turn them around by going that way, and hopefully they can land on the platform there. one walker ahead of the others. This is just too perfect. Well, not anymore, there's not. Oh. 
perfect. Okay. YouTube bash, bash for there. Oh no, you guys are too close together. It is very bad, because I want them to be trapped right around there. So, new plan. You are going to bash. You are going to be the first climber. Hits that, turns around, and of course, because he's an idiot, he won't actually land on that platform. He wants to land lower than that. Well, stop it, you doofus. You don't get special treatment. So I do need... Okay, so... Well, that's a bit unfortunate. <laughs> I have two gliders. I'm sorry, what? That's not allowed. Still have an extra fencer. That could be very helpful. Because that guy needs time to stack, so we could delay him by using a fencer. suck. Once again, Flopsy, that is stupid. You can't do that. There are... Wow. There are so many stupid veins on this level. Really, really stupid veins. Why even put the platform there if you can't land on it? can't seriously be suggesting that we have to find a way to go backwards. Alright. 
Ja. Hey, no, that's a trap. It's like Admiral Akbar said. <sighs> All right. Take 187. Not sure what to do about this idiot here. Still not gonna freaking work. Urgh. Hmm. My idea was like send well, I mean, some back down there. But they'd have to be gliders to do that, and I need to wait on them to sign them gliders so they can fly down there. My idea was really good and simple. You land on here, you build twice, because apparently you can't build out of that wall. Come back this way. Uh, you can send two gliders that way. One of them goes here, blocks there. Uh, the other glider hits him, turns around. Or even better, no. Before he hits him, he bashes to free him, but hits the steel block. Turns around, builds once to save them from there. Well, that means you were trapped in there, can just bash your fence out, and boom, they go to freedom. You'd think that would work, but no. Because of the stupid pixel-perfect everything. Actually, pixel-perfect makes it sound like it's good. Horribly placed by the wrong pixel. That's better. I guess you could bash her there. Build. Like, bash her there. No, that would be that's a stupid idea. Okay. So I've got a good thing here. These guys are trapped, but they can be let out at any time, and they can go down to safety. So I'll send that guy up. Don't see any way to really spare a builder. Well, I guess... Okay. Let us waste many stackers. 
because one builder is more valuable than two stackers in this point in time. I am going to get this to freaking work because this has got to be the only way to do it. I do not see any other way you could rationally do this. Mr. Athlete. I need him. puzzles. Wait, how did I got... There was one worker, Walker, blah, 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 who was by himself. Where did he go? We'll just have to make one. You 
are so stupid. I mean, I know you're lemmings, but still. I expect at least a little smartness. Breaking me. You hear me? This really sucks. So much. So much. Where can I spare a basher? Up there? Up there. Yes. You know, back to like the freaking beginning of the level. Watch closely, kids who are watching at home, as you watch Artie's sanity plummet to next to nothing. Because I have spent an hour and 20 minutes on this one stupid level.
Oh, you two guys are too close together. Does it really depend on when you fence? Because if so, that is very dumb. Last. Cool. So while they are heading out, you will climb up. I forget to do that again! Doggone it! Oh. 
No, 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 no. Not this again. Alright. It looks like we have to have a new plan. Yet again. You're gonna ruin everything. Again. <sighs> Alright, you I need to get way ahead of him. Way ahead. That's good. That should be good. Now that is way ahead. So I'm going to have the uh, the athlete who's coming. He is going to bash the way for the athletes. This guy is going to build because he's not a glider. He'll survive, and then we can just have these guys bash the other top. You are the athlete, and those guys went past, which is not good. Here we go, here we go. Okay. This should work out. Oh no, now we don't have a lone guy to do the stacker. I hope that buys enough time, because we're not going to get a lot of it. You suck. We do have a spare ration. Why did you still do that? Just the game plan a bit, but I think this should work out. Here's Mr. Athlete. Okay. So we have three bashers left, we'll need one there, one there, one here. Okay. So I'm 37. You're also I'm gonna have to bash lower than that.
This better be worth it. It won't be, I can already tell. Alright, where's Mr. Glider? Oh, perfect. Well, I can't say that. None of this has almost been perfect. I want to know why that guy's not turning around. Because he should be turning around. There we go! Good grief! We can. One fencer won't get them out. Oh, it will! It will get them out! And with a glider, we can give that guy a bit of a head start to fence for this. Oh, dear lord. Congratulations, Flopsy. You just gave me a level that I actually hate more than the Rickroll level. Yes, that's right. This is a worse level than the Rickroll level. Because this one took me over an hour and a half to do in one sitting. Guess what? We don't have time for another episode. We don't have time for another level. Because that one was freaking ridiculous. And I used pretty much every single skill, so I'm pretty sure that was the intended solution, which is frightening. Because holy cow, that is completely out of place for its difficulty rank. That should be like Rapture 20. <laughs> that... Good luck topping that level for hardest level in the game, because that surpassed the Slime Castle, and that surpassed the Rickroll level in terms of annoyance. Now, I think I'm going to end the episode before I say something that I regret. Thank you for watching. If you watched all an hour and 55 minutes, all one hour and 35 minutes of this, hats off to you. I would not have watched all of that. But I very much appreciate it. Hope to see you next time, where hopefully we'll conquer more than one level in less than an hour and a half. I don't think that's too much to ask. Have a great day, and God bless.